Everything we believe, we just see
All right, what's up, everybody? Happy Sunday. Hope everybody's having a good day. How is it going? We're alive. I am stuffed. Like, food-wise, I can't even... I can't even. I'm so full from food. But I hope everybody's having a good day. Thank you guys for stopping by the channel. It is Sunday. Normally, we do alternate Sunday, but today we're going to try to make some progress with... um. Maybe some armor drops, legendary armor class armor drops. Um, we're going to do COV, OOB, maybe start the um, sort of destiny timeline depending on time or whatever happens with the zones. I don't know. Usually running COV and OOB usually drains me after that. But um, we'll see what happens, how, quick it, how quickly it goes. If anybody wants to get in on the group, I know Nid and Jorm, or Jorman, or wanting to do um, armor runs. I don't know if they're available right now. or give them a little bit before they come in the channel. But uh, we'll get something going. Reach out to some guildies. See if they want to come. Help us run these zones. And we'll go from there. I don't even know what that is that I just got. Pride skin gourd. I'm out here gathering for... One, to replenish, I mean, not that the guild depot needs it right now, but I did use a lot of resources grinding to 70, so I'm trying to gather up some other ones. What did we get here? We got a Nimbus Root and a Bristle Skin Gourd. I don't think I've ever seen that one before. That's not the Blood Orange. I'm looking for Blood Oranges is what I'm looking for. But we'll take it, right? A rare is a rare. Hope everybody's having a good Sunday. Thank you guys. We had a good stream yesterday. It was a nice, relaxing EverQuest 2 stream. We um, did our prerequisites that are we can for right now for Epic. So we'll just have to wait for Canark to come down on that one. And what else did we do yesterday? Oh, we did um, by hook or by crook. By hook or something like that. By hook the heritage quest for the... Um, what's the name of this thing? I have it in my inventory somewhere. Here it is. The Hierophant's Crook. So now, when my um, wizard and um, Inquisitor get to the right level, we, they can claim that one. What's well, up, uh, Kobe? He just logged in. What character did he log into? Anonymous. Anonymous. So yeah. How are you guys doing? I don't want you, but I shall kill you. I kind of wish EverQuest 2 you could harvest mobs instead of just looting them. So I got the bot working with Discord. The thing is with the bot, I can only have it join one server. And when it joins that server, that's where it that's where it now lives. So on my Discord, which if you type exclamation point Discord, that'll give you the link for the Discord channel. You can use that anytime, even if I'm offline. Um you'll see the casual taverns server there. And now when I go live, it'll also shoot an announcement on that server as well that I'm live just in case Twitch is being finicky and not sending out alerts on time. And I did test it today and it worked. There's the first announcement in there and it shows you a link so you can just click on that and it pops right up in um, whatever application you're using to view Twitch. And we can come right in to the game. It felt bad yesterday because I went live earlier on Saturday than I'm normally live. So I didn't get to group with the guys that I normally group with. But we still had a good time. I moved my mic arm again because I'm just never happy with my decks set up. Who is Ugly Mush? They're on my friends list. Who's Ugly Mush? Are you in, the, are you in chat? 
They are on my friends list, and I don't remember who they are. What are they? Does it show? Community? Nope. Anonymous. I don't know. I don't know who that is. Alright, but we'll just do some farming here real quick. Actually, I should go ahead and pull up the Sword of Destiny timeline. Because I think there are some things that I need to do. I don't need the background. Players wishing to begin the first chapter of the Swords of Destiny can speak to Sir Groka, Groktog in the Common Lands at the Ruins of Valmar. Alright. Let's go do that real quick so we can at least get that started. Um, common lands. Anybody porting? Is Flora in Guildhall? Nope, she's in Crushbone Keep. Um, this way to common lands would be. Well, I don't want to use... Okay, let's do that. Alright, but yeah, that was uh, my news. I did that last night. Played some more um, Shroud yesterday evening, on and off. Starting to get the hang of that game, even though it's still very, very... um. Hardcore, in my opinion. But it is fun. It's very intriguing. Put it that way. And we are right here, next to where we need to be. Well, no. We need to be... Crap. Here. I need to go south. And then we'll wait for Nid and Jorm. They want to do COV or something or OOB, we'll go do that. But I hope everybody's doing well and thank you. I clipped uh, the Barbie moment today. I clipped it this morning actually. You can find that on the Twitter on Twitter or if you clip on if you clip on if you click hey. on. How you doing? Hey there, Shiny. How's it going? Happy Sunday. If you click on clips, you'll see it should be one of the most recent clips. But it was a little Barbie, Daddy Barbie moment yesterday during the stream. My daughter brought in her Barbie and her sunglasses were stuck in her hair. So I had to do do some daddy skills and resolve this the crisis. Alright. Um, there should be... Frog lock. And I got a location. Copy. Backslash way. Do paste. He's over this way. There he is. Does not have a feather on his head, but we'll talk to him anyways. Finally, Mara sent me a worthy assistant. What is your name and how and are you ready to serve the Order of Mar, Defenders of Valor and Love? My name is Rebus. Is this what I'm supposed to be doing? The Rotating Cavaliers. Yep, it's a level 55 quest inside the Common Lands. We'll accept the quest. Then I salute you for your bravery. Your crusade is to liberate a number of sacred or, yeah, sacred Cavalier statues in the common lands. Evil spirits must. Evil spirits have been bound to them. You must destroy the, them for Mar. Good luck, Rebus. May Mar go with you. I shall. Let's go ahead and open up this quest real quick, just so I don't get surprised by anything. It says I need to destroy the evil spirit bound to the Cavalier statue located near the Mar. Valmar, which I'm assuming it's this guy over here. No, maybe not. See, this is why we, um... Yeah, it is over here. You must spawn when I go over this way. If anybody needs this quest, holler now. 
and I will, we can group up and do it. There he goes. He is a green one up. Might as well get warmed up with this. Like, I need a warm up. I can almost play this character with no skills. Alright, I need to destroy the evil spirit bound to the cavalier statue located where the avatar of war was defeated. Oh crap, I forgot. Did you check your mail? My mail. Which mail? Game again game mail? I did not check um are you talking about Rebus's? Which character, Shiny? Avatar of War, which he would be. Rebus? I don't it doesn't show that I have any mail. Mail. Office of the Harbor Master. Bottle was found in the harbor immediately after you were last there. It is your blah 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 blah. I don't know. What, was I supposed to have something? Oh wait, I forgot I can't mail it. See? You're confusing me. You're getting all freaked out. I'm like, what? Alright, I got a thing to paste in here. Paste. You have something for me? Ooh, I got gifts. I got gifts, guys. If it's a Barbie, I don't want it. Okay? I got enough of them. I got plenty of Barbies, and some of them are very, um, damaged. Damaged Barbies. Because little girls are mean to dolls. So if it's a Barbie, I don't want it. Well, I'm in the common lands, shiny, or unless you need me to run to you, or we can meet up later. You know what I have not listened to? Epic. I knew it. I heard the sound effect go off, and I was like, I got, that's got to be epic coming to the channel. What's up, man? How's it going? Hope you're doing well. I'm gonna spawn this guy real quick. But I don't want to fight him there. I want to fight him right here. Doing good, hey all Nice. Um, Epic, do you want to run COV and OOB? I don't know when we're going to get started. I'm waiting for um, Yorman and Nid to log in. I'm in a group in CMM trying to complete a latter part of this quest. Gotcha, man. It's all good. I can, get, I can catch up on stuff right now anyways. Once Nid gets on, then we can get a group going and do the UF in instances if y'all want. I think you're just watching at the moment. Gotcha, man. It's all good. It's all good. I appreciate it. Alright, who's the next one we got it to? I need to destroy the evil spirits bound to the Cavalier statues located at the end of the path. Uh, Cubby, what tune today on alternate Sunday? Oh. Sorry, Carl. I 
to break the news to Carl. Alternate Sunday is not a go today, guys. Hopefully he's not too angry with me. He's angry. All he replied back was okay. That means he's cussing me out right now. Whenever it's just said a word, hey, word. Just messing. I can come meet you in the guild house if you want, shiny. What do I have over here? Some kind of turn in over here for something. I gotta talk to somebody over here? Okay, pop it in. Well met. You're asking a question to be answered. What are you doing? I'm looking for things, looking closely. All the land unused, unused. That is a waste. We will fix that. We know our way around here, around dirt. Dig up some here. Push dirt aside there. Yes, yes, this is perfect. Nothing stands in the way of progress. You may stay on the way. They may go. I don't, what are you talking about? I don't even know what you're for. Wind blowing, smell that? No. Disturbance. Where is this quest from? Level 50 quest world event. Okay, whatever you say. Alright, popping into the guild house real quick like. Nope, that's trust. That's the quest log. We're going to go to the housing. Go to relapse. Hey, Lalina. Happy Sunday. Hey, how you doing? How's it been going, Alina? I've been following the thread in um, Discord about y'all talking about DKP and something. Sounds like y'all got a bunch of work, or had a bunch of work. What is this? Dang. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Shiny. Oh, she's gone. I can't bow. I was trying to... I appeared to thank myself. Thank you, Shiny. I'm doing pretty good. I am so full from lunch that I will probably skip dinner. <laughs> I hate when I eat. I overeat sometimes. I'm a ninja. Yeah. We're going to straighten it out, I saw. Yeah, I, I totally have faith in y'all. I mean, I don't even know what y'all are talking about. I know what DKP is, but... That's it. I was just reading through it, and it looks like you guys got had a lot of stuff going on. Yeah, it's supposed to be Alt Sunday, but we were talking about it yesterday. Um, Jorman and Nid wanted to run some EOF instances, and they want me to start the Sword of Destiny timeline. So we kind of put we put a halt on the alternate Sunday this weekend. It'll be back next Sunday. Might even do an extended version of Alternate Sunday. We might, um, depending on how playtime goes and whatnot, um, we'll do we'll do Alternate Sunday either in the morning, and then I'll come back on that night and we can run EOF instances again or something. I don't have the kids next weekend, so I'll have some time to... I don't think we have any plans either for Sunday. I probably should... Check that before I even say anything. But I'm bad about that. But we'll do alternate Sunday next weekend. Where it's kind of getting close to being not alternate Sunday. Because some of our our alternates are level 30s now. So it's like... Well, I guess it's still alternate because we're playing alternate characters. Still have others coming up through it. Yeah, right now I'm just I'm just starting it. Like I'm on the first the first quest right now. So I'm trying to find these things. Which I've already forgot where I was at. Did I kill the second one? Yes, I killed the second one. So I gotta kill the third one. Um, way. Yep, alter alts no matter how I have level. That's right. I know Kobe looks forward to alternate Sundays too, and I feel bad telling him that we pushed, we canceled it. But it's good to mix it up every once in a while so I don't get bored, you know?
in our um I know he likes being our Norath uh I should I should add the shame sound effect. You know that epic from uh, Game of Thrones? Shame. Shame. Kobe has alts of alts of alts, yeah. <laughs> But yeah, um, wait till I get to the statue step. I hear it's pretty bad. Isn't there like two statues for every zone or something that you got to go find? You all know me in these long drawn out quests. Like I didn't do Claymore. I just chose to stop with Claymore. And more than likely that might happen with Sword of Destiny. Hey guys, what you guys up to? They want a piece. But no, sort of destiny. The only thing, the only thing with these long quests are the raid parts because I can't, I can't designate time to log in and do the raids that I need and by the time I can most guilds have already moved on to the next content you know so I'm not going to start a, I don't really like starting quest series that take up a lot of time and then I can't finish them fifty total fifty statues total but just a lot of running around not tough got you no raid part for SOD it's optional at least oh okay like the only ones, the only raid ones that I'm gonna for sure want to do, and I will probably try to set aside time for it, are the epic ones. Because I, if I do the epic, I want to make sure I do the epic correctly and I get the, you know, the actual epic weapon. Not the legendary one, which I'm gonna do the legendary one, but I'm gonna upgrade it to the epic one if I can. If I can. Well, we are pretty much farming free thinkers and inner sanctum on Sundays. Nice. Very nice. So that's why, I mean, and Norman brought up, he, he gave me, I mean, he brought a pretty good idea. So I went ahead and did the prerequisites for Epic 1.0. And um, I got those done yesterday. So we're ready for Canark to come down just so we can start on that series of quests. But we should be good. And then this sort of destiny might, you know, might take a while, but we'll get it done. All right, so speak back. I got to go back to... Groktog, near the ruins of Valmar. So if you all need um, Mei Young to finish up, that is easy. Nice. Um, Lalina, what if um, Yorm or Nid needed a guild to run them through that? I know they're part of... Um, Reckoning of Honor or something like that? How would, how does that work for you guys? They haven't asked. I'm asking just in so I have knowledge. If somebody comes in the channel and they're looking for somebody to help them get a quest update. Because I know you all have like a raid system that they have to apply for. And, um, you know, there's spots that they have to sign up for. Oh, I'm not I'm not sure. I was just, I'm, I'm just wondering. <laughs> Epics, too freaking bad. <laughs> Epic's hardcore. He's like, no. No, nah, man. Not getting in on this. You gotta have a relapse tag. This ain't no charity. We don't do charity work here in EverQuest 2. I mean, I might... I don't I don't know. I don't even know if that's a thing. Like, maybe, maybe they do have to have a relapse tag if they needed help with something. And I don't know where their guild's at raid progression-wise anyways. I was just wanting for my knowledge, like if somebody, if somebody was to come in the channel and say, Hey, do you know of anybody raiding, doing this quest line? And they're already involved in another guild that might not be as big as relapse or as experienced as relapse. Like what, I don't know what I would tell them at that point. I'm just a peon, Lelina sits on a fancy chair. <laughs> well met. I see you have served us well. The Order of Mar thanks you, but your reward has, but the reward you have earned will not come in a conventional form. For this deed, I have to put a single coin to offer you. 
single coin. I'm not taking a single coin. What is a waste of time? Farewell. This I accept. Your single coin. I shall spend it wisely. The coin can only be spent in the down below beneath the streets of Kinos. Valor's, Valor's journey begins behind the statue of another. Thank you. I got a crow coin. All right. Let's do this. So now... Yes, uh, my raid leads would have to say on that. My initial belief is that to be tagged, but doesn't hurt to ask if it ever came up. I'm a flexible leader, but I give my raid leads full discretion. Yeah, I got you. I told you. Awesome. Yeah, I was just making sure. Just making sure. I mean, anybody that comes in channel, I always refer them to the relapse guild to, you know, seek out a recruiter, recruiting officer or something like that if they wanted, if they need a guild. I just wasn't sure for people that have been on the server and have joined other raiding guilds. Like, maybe, I don't know where they're at. That's all I was wondering. It makes sense, though, the way you all do it so far. All right. That one's done. So that's going to put us to a crusade to Fade Weir. This, is, this quest is part two of the Swords of Destiny timeline. Speak with Sir Wolfgang Moat in Crow's Resting Place, Thieves Guild. Moat will send you to Kelthen to speak with Lady Jaleel. What? Where's this Crow's Resting Place? The down below? Is that in Kinos or that is that Freeport? That's Freeport, right? The down below? Hey, Chris Crow, what's up, man? See, we're back on EverQuest 2. How's it going? Chris Crow came in the channel the other night, and I was doing um, Shroud of the Avatar, and he's like, did you quit EverQuest 2? I was like, no, man. Just trying out some new stuff. Yeah, that's awesome. Thank you. Yeah, Jorman did. I would love to help out if they need it. I, I'm, they, didn't, they didn't ask me to ask or anything like that. I was just wondering. Bought a new PC. Still didn't download EQ2. Must play it soon. Gotcha, man. Yeah. Just so they know. Very cool. Yeah, Relapse has been an awesome guild. I have no complaints. Everybody's been super nice, super helpful. Highly recommend it if you're playing on Fallen Gate server. PUBG is taking, is taking my attention. Gotcha. You don't like Fortnite, Chris? Or you like the more realistic um, PUBG style. We love the bus. <laughs> Shroud of the Avatar. Something, something, something. Come over to the dark side. <laughs> I got you, Patch Up. Yeah, man. Dude, I was in I was in um I was in Shroud last night. I'm finally getting the hang of the deck building for your um, skills and stuff like that. I went and watched some videos on it. So I'm getting the hang of that. And um, what else was I messing with last night? Oh, I was messing with um the whole well, I was trying to get the Resolute, and the city was blocked by some kind of siege or something like that, so it kept having me run through this zone to get to the city, and I was getting confused because I was just getting sucked into combat inside the um, inside the siege, and I was just spending most of my time just in there fighting things. Then I realized what it was because I had to go look for a video to find out what the fuck sieges were and how do I get by them. That's Thieves' Way. Down below is under Thieves' Way. That's right. Too cartoonish. Like Real War. Got gotcha. you. So you're probably you're probably like a fan of like uh, Battlefield and the Battlefield series in general. Have you played any of those, Chris? I'm not going to lie, though. Shroud... Shroud has um, scratched that part of the brain, for sure. I more than likely... Um, I don't know if I'll buy the game this month. Maybe next month I might pick it up, depending on how bills work out and whatnot. I got kids' birthdays next month. 
But um, yeah, it definitely is a fun game to me. I'm trying to get into the crafting, but finding resources seems to be pretty um different. Unless I go buy it from city vendors and stuff like that, like um like other player owned towns. Um, to down below. I'm in Thieves. Down below. Serpent Sewer. Play Battlefield, but not too much for the fan. I like multiplayer side by side. Some player who can communicate with PUBG. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Kino Sewers? Am I in the wrong sewers? I'm in the wrong sewers. Yeah, because I'm good, ain't I? I'm in the wrong flipping sewers. Alright. Let's call back to Kinos. Oh, it's all good, Alina. It's all good. Sometimes I forget that I'm a good aligned character instead of evil. I'll wait until next update stream. They always have sales then, and you will get reward purchasing during that event. Oh, nice. Nice patch up. Oh, it's all good, Lilina. All good. There is a zone to the down below there. Yep. I should have known that. I should have known down below was Kinos. You pretty much started streaming when the server opened up, right? You have improved your stream all around and grown very nice. Oh, thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah, I started, I actually started streaming like two weeks before the server because I was like, I want to get back into EverQuest 2. So I started streaming it and I was on the live servers and I was just having such a hard time relearning the game on the live servers. So. Oh, drum is here in 200 bits. Thank you, man. Thank you for the bits. I appreciate it. That brings us up to 20% of our goal, April goal. Um, but yeah, I was playing on the live servers and like even the viewers, were I was just having a hard time relearning the game. There were so many systems, Yay! so many points to spend, all this other stuff that I was like, they're like, well, we have, there's a TLE opening in two weeks. So just stick it out to that. Join the Fallen Gate server. And, um, and I've been here since. I mean, I haven't left the Fallen Gate server. I've logged into Skyfire once or twice just to show people my characters that I had over there, but that was it. But yeah, man, thank, thank you for the compliment. I appreciate it. All right, so we are down here. The quest disappeared. Why did my quest disappear? I need to find this guy. Of course, he's not giving me a location for him. Note the crow's resting place is in an instant zone accessed by clicking the statue at blah blah blah. And the down below. Down below is accessible through Vermin Snai, Kinos, City Kinos. Note that you must suspend your mercenary. We don't have mercenaries yet. While in the crow's resting place, consider speaking to the bartender and buying two language primers, Guten and Koadal. If you don't have them already, you'll need the languages for future parts of the quest. All right, so we got to buy two languages down there and all that fun stuff. Um, way. That's some high quality mic. Is it too loud? Or are you being sarcastic and it's really bad mic? I changed where my mic arm was. I can't, I just can't, um... I'm not happy with my desk layout and I change it like it feels like every three weeks I'm changing something on my desk and usually I end up going right back to where I was. Oh, thank you then. Thank you, Chris. It's better than that headset mic I was using. The headset mic I was using was terrible. All right, so we're at the statue. A statue with a strange intention, indentation, and in, indention. I can't read, guys. Place the coin in the palm. And that zones us into the Crow's Resting Place, Thieves Guild. Hmm. 
So we're going to buy. Join the club. <laughs> yeah. Like I was telling September girl, there's this, we have, there's like a crafting table in our garage. And I was like, I think I can use that for a computer desk. She's like, yeah, but if you put that in there, nobody can walk around. I'm like, well, you don't need to walk around in the office. It's where we, I sit at the computer all the time, but she uses the office as a crafting room. So she wouldn't be able to get around in here very well. Since we share the office. But it almost came in here. I was like, I can get a new desk. I'll just make this my desk now. All right, there's Sir Wolfgang. And then I need to buy some languages from people in here. We've got some dancing halflings that look like the Hamburglar, but in bl black and red. We got the uh, Fiddlewig. Got some flaming fire guy that apparently is warm. Got a bartender. Mr. Iron Toe. These guys that kind of look fancy. All right, let's go talk to this guy. Well met. Prefer to dine alone. My apologies. I can see the armor beneath that robe. What is the cavalier doing in these nest of thieves? Oh, crafting rooms. Those fellas know how to party. <laughs> A uh, crafting, yeah. September Girl is a huge um, crafter. She does paper craft. Um, she has like a heat press in here where she presses shirts for orders that she gets. All sorts of stuff. Trust me, the Ratunga would know know these things. <laughs> gotcha. But yeah, there's the I I would say she probably has about sixty percent of the office, and I have the other forty percent. And of that 40%, 35% is my desk. So. You should have seen her face when I was like said I was going to paint the wall behind me green. She was like, no. Plus our renter wouldn't let us do that anyway. So I got this cloth hanging up behind me. I prefer to dine alone. I can see that. Sometimes a night must delve into the darkness. It has been in the shadows and secrets. It is in the shadows... That secrets may hide. I doubt you have served my order. We are not the kind that get involved in the affairs of thieves and trotters. Mar save you from all your lust. Oh, am I talking to this guy incorrectly? Speak to... No, it doesn't say that I have to tell him anything directly. Keep it down. The name of Mar can scare these rats from the darkness. And those rats whisper in the secrets. So there's the Ratonga. Forgive me. Rebus. Crusader of the Common Lands. Has I heard Grotog speak your name? You are a noble adventurer. I am Sir Wolfgang. It was unclear at first. I was bewildered as to why Lady Aurelis would send me night after night into the hive. But now it is clear. I, send, I have... I was sent here to meet you. Okay. Your devotion and bravery purge the evil from cavaliers proves me you are made of the right metal. And your assistance to Mar proves your worth. Just send me where I need to go. I cannot say. Not even that I know the details of the Crusader's Fair, blah blah blah. You must gain transport to Fate Weir. Once there, seek out the Majesty Majesty of the Forest known as Greater Fate Arc. Got you. At first I was going to do, but whispers in the secret tavern now point me in another direction on a new crusade. Alright, so we got a level 60 quest here. With some loots. Not legendary loots. I don't... Uh, one of these might actually be an upgrade. Computer equal cutting edge graphics card, huge SSD storage, best CPU out there. Uber cooling system, computer desk, cardboard boxes, and duct tape. Yeah, that sounds about right. Yeah, pretty much... <laughs> Yeah, actually, my next purchase is going to be a new chair. I need a new chair. My chair, the right side of my armrest has snapped off. So, like, when I'm sitting in the chair, I'm actually sitting like this. So, I have to, like, force my body to lean this way so it's somewhat even. So, now, like, I lean this way. I can almost fall out of the chair from 
the brace that's broken over here. So I need to replace the chair. And then after that, then I can worry about an actual desk. Because right now I have this, it is almost like a particle board desk. It's like a corner desk thing that needs to be replaced as well. Gangster lean. What's the highest level here? I forgot. The toy. 70 is the highest level. Yeah. I have a level 70. This is a level 70 monk and a level 70 um, provisioner. We'll accept the quest and we'll say farewell. And now we need to go by languages, which it said to talk to. On the crowd, consider speaking to the bartender and buying two language primers. Buy from merchant. You want to buy the Gukton and the Koa Dadal language primer. You learn the basics of the Korodar language. Very cool. AAs is um a hundred AAs. What does that ninety mean? Yeah, that's that's my um alternate achievement points, which I need to spend anyways. So you have you have this one which is fifty, and then the monk achievement, which is another fifty. Oh yeah, my level is seventy, so I can change that it's over there. So it says seventy right there. And then once Kunark comes down, I think it goes, does it go to 80? It goes to 80 when Kunark hits. And then level, and then my trade skill experience is level 70 as well. That's well, all maxed out. Thank you, Jerome. Yeah, 80. All right, so we got those languages. Do I need to do anything with those books? Nope, they just get automatically absorbed into my brain. Oh, I can put these on now. So Shiny gave me some armor, guys. Got Wu's Fighting Wraps and Wu's Fighting Battalions. Pantaloons, pantaloons. Two pieces, very cool. We'll tune that. We'll equip that and attune that. Those are replacing my other um, monk gear. They really put a huge effort in this game. Well, you got to think too. This game came out in 2004. I mean... The amount of time this game's been out and the stuff they put into it is ridiculous. I mean, and plus these expansions were what a year apart on when they were live, and on this server TLA we're getting them every twelve weeks. So it's it's a lot of content being shrunk down into a twelve week time frame, which is what some people are starting to worry about with Canark getting ready. Well, Canark's still got another five to six weeks before it releases. But um, a lot of people are getting worried that Canark 12 weeks isn't enough time to get through the Canark content. Which they might be right. I don't know about the raid content. But um, I know like just normal legendary stuff, it's going to be pretty hard to do it in 12 weeks with, without playing you know, a huge amount of time. Because Canark, those, those zones are huge. And the quest lines are huge. But it is one of my most, it's one of my favorite zones. All right, so now we need to go, I must speak to Lady Lena Jill Knight in Kelethan, which we're just gonna go ahead and go to the Guild Home, which is the corridor to Relapse Detox Center. You cannot visit a house from here? Of course not. So we'll go into the down below. We did everything that we needed to do there. So now we need to go talk to Lady, Greater Fate Arc, Housing, Corridor, Visit, Duck Norris is in the guild, that's somebody's name, just hit level 10. It's 
it's going to be a lot. It's going to be tough fitting every day, everything into the time frame for ROK. Yeah. Yep, that's what I'm hearing too. From the forums to the in game chat to general chat, people are saying that 12 weeks might be rough to fit all that content in. They might. They might, actually. I mean, I was thinking that, too. I'm like, it wouldn't be hard for them to. It's not like anybody... I don't think anybody would complain or, or you know, get mad if they pushed it back some. Haha, -ha, I got you. I got you. Using the flower. He can't find me. Who's the ninja now? All right, so we're here. Let's go find Lady. Got a waypoint, which we'll just type in backslash way. Paste the waypoint gives me a little nice glowing trail. <laughs> it's all good. Zoom in when I go in these tiny houses. I like your sword. It's very Final Fantasy of you. Salutations. Well, salutations to you too. Do you see these trees? These trees have def okay, defied the gods. All well, they have endured. Okay, she's dancing in front of me. Oh, she's okay. Curtsy. Gotcha. I come from a long line of dancers. The house of Geo is available. Every woman in my esteemed house danced with millions of... Okay, okay. I got you. You don't have to give me a life story. My home is... Ad okay. Oops. I, I must not Greetings. have talked to her correctly. She's going to dance. It's beautiful. I must go. Okay. 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 What did I have to say to her? You have 12 minutes to harvest six jars. Okay, after I do that, so this is going to start a timer. Um, a knight of the Order of Mara finds their home in valor and love and not in any city. You're the one sent by Sir Wolfgang. Okay. Yes, I have come to help. You shall know when the time is right. The time is not now. Please assist me in gathering the rhythm. Rhyme. Rhythm. From around Kelthin. Do so and then I shall inform you. What is rhyme? The rhymes are the rare fairy folk. Very well. Got a jar. Very well. Okay, okay, okay. Let's go do this. 12 minutes. Copy. Way, paste, go. I don't see a path. There it is. Don't get stuck in another house, Rebus. Don't get stuck in a little mini house. Happened yesterday in Rivervale. That friggin' stuck in that house was having a panic attack. Away for waffles? <laughs> gotcha. Am I going down? Do I need to go down? Going down. Oh boy. Hey Lance, what's up man? Didn't expect you on EQ2, but I'm glad you're on. Yeah. Why would you expect uh, Saturday and Sundays are gonna stay EQ2? I don't unless the servers are down or something, that would be the only reason I'd play something else. Right now. T Tuesdays we'll get Shroud of Avatar Love. Shh, Nikes, where am I going here? Did I get up there? Where is this trail have me going?
Are you kidding me? All right, there's one. That was two minutes of my life. Copy. Away. Sorry, I guess I didn't understand your schedule. No, it's all good, man. It's all good. It's all good. Oh, I can't, I can't jump that far. Jump that far, though. Oh, I hit the roof. That's not good. Okay. So all of the things are up here. I I did a bad by going downstairs. And where are you? You piece this freaking trail. The X is right there. Oh my goodness. I'm not going to finish this in time. Flipping kidding me right now. Flipping hate this zone. Might as well just start this over again. Get me up there. There's two. You know what? I'm not following the path. I'm going towards the X. I'm just going to go towards the X. I'm not following this orange path. This is going to lead me astray. I waste my time. I'll have to do this all over again. I swear to goodness. Oh, I hate this flipping zone. Of course, it's right there, too. Come on. What the hell? Is it down below? God damn it. It says it's right here. Might as well just start this over. Yeah, but the trails are all jacked up. And then when I get here, it's not it's not right here, it's somewhere else. Or 
Or is it above me? God damn it. I think I failed this, guys. Okay. Last one. Hit the ceiling there. Is that the last one? Three minutes to spare. The timer stressed me out, man. All right, good. doing fine. Like I said, their last three are really easy to choose from. 45 seconds. Nice. Kelthin is a labyrinth and all EQ gate. That is true. That is true. I remember my first character, in EQ, one of my first characters in EQ1 was a um, wood elf. As soon as I got in that zone, I made another character. I was like, nope, that's not the starting zone I want. Okay, he lost to that. <laughs> oh, jeez. That's what the copper's there for, guys. Gamble it away. Dad jokes. I really want to buy one of those Super Mario checkout dividers. But the cashier keeps putting it back. <laughs> what? I'm going to do that next time. See if anybody says anything. Just keep putting it back. Be like, no, I want to buy this. Why do you keep putting it back? It's in my groceries. I get kicked out of the grocery store. She is. Greetings. The prancer has returned from the dead. Do you have the rhyme for me? I sure do. I performed the deed, but there was something odd. What was so odd about collecting the rhyme? They are quite friendly and most tiny. The memorial rhymed was. Oh, nothing was odd. Okay. I right, thank you. Let me listen to your melody. That is quite terrible. And she's raging. It would seem though something has befallen their conclave. Here is the Greater Fate Arc. They sing a song of destruction. Their home is destroyed. We will need to inspect this ourselves. I cannot do this. I am here to aid the greater deeds. 
I will go out in their conclave and inspect it for the Order of Mar. I will turn it later to aid. Um, does it say which one I need to answer? Not really. All right, I will go out and do it for the Order of Mar. Prance unto the forest floor, okay? I shall return. I must locate the gully of Ursa rhyme. Oh, fucking tiny houses. Just gotta stand out in the open. They will call the supermarket police man arrested in aisle nine. Where does one buy the here buy her sword? I can own the one hand, right? I don't I don't know actually. I know I have the um the little ring that has the sword that floats around me. The human uh or the I guess the human particle effect thing that floats around me it looks like that sword. I don't have the ring on me right now, it's in my bank. But it has like a particle effect that floats around me. I did that in Kinos. But I don't know where you can actually get that sword. I'm sure it's on marketplace somewhere. Or I wonder if you can buy it from one of the, like the um, city vendors. All right, so locate the gully of Ursa near the chessboard and beehive looking things in northwestern Greater Faderk. At then there's the location. And examine the five items there. Close ups of all pictures are on the talk page. I care about your talk page. All right, um, flash way, paste, and go. We're running, we're running, we're running. Ratunga Cloud roleplay. <laughs> That'd be good. It's, it's just cosplay, but in game. Right? That's a thing. Where am I at? Okay. There we go. Going up. I think it's above there, isn't it? There's the beehive. There's the gong. Find the place in Steamfont Mountains where Inspector Burlock lives. Burtok. Steamfont is down here. Nope, that's Lesser Fadark. There is a horse here. Steamfont is there. We'll take the horse over to the Steamfont zone. I think that one drops like that in Nizera. Nizera? That's the Fallen Dynasty Hello. instance. Right? Am I right? Kinos Claymore. Okay. Hope everybody's having a good Sunday. Thank you guys for stopping by the channel and hanging out. I appreciate it. We we're going to do some COV and OOB at some point. Um, Jorman's busy right now and I'm waiting for Nid to come online. But if we don't get to it, we are working on, we are starting the Swords of Destiny. I'm on part two of Sword of Destiny timeline. That's what we're working on right now, in case anybody's wondering. And we're just chit-chatting, hanging out. A 
A noob doing OOB? Correct. But I, I mean, I've been through OOB twice now, I think, or three times with you guys. So I kind of got the stuff down. So it won't take as long as normal, I don't think, anyways. There's Dazzling. He used to be in, um... What, um... Atlantis Rising. And then he quit because... Um... I forget the reason why, actually. Or is OOB doing the noob? Probably a little bit of both. We'll take turns. We like to share. So consider it, Rebus? Yeah, right? Is Ugly Mush here in the channel? I don't know whose alt that is. They're on my friends list and I don't remember who that is. Alright, where am I going? Where am I at? I'm right here. Where am I going in here? Go to the Gnomeland Security Headquarters in Steamfont Mountains and talk to Inspector Burlock at location. I kind of remember where the where it's at anyways. Vaguely. I remember this zone a little bit. It's got level 30 zone, I think. 35-ish? Yeah. I should probably come do this timeline on, um... Well, I'm still working the Butcher Block timeline, actually. But I was gonna say, you should come here on my Inquisitor. time to be alive. Have you ever noticed the beautiful moon in these days? It is much more beautiful than the one I gazed upon in my youth. In my days, it was a great investigator before the TBI, the Tinkerer Bureau of Investigation. I solved some of the greatest unsolved mysteries of the times, tinkering mysteries, that is. Investigator? What's that? Never heard of it. Okay. Schnikes, I answered it wrong. God nice bless it. Of course, I gotta talk to him with certain... Okay. What did you do in your youth? Wish I could be a great investigator. When you were young, you must have been a great writer. I think reading helps you stay young. When you were young, did you ever get lost? In your younger days, you must have taught the Gnomeland security all you know. You were crazy when you were young, or is this an old age thing? I am the general of... Uh, okay. When you were young, you must have seen some splendid shields. That account for two books, where is the last? Lass, you say? Oh yes, I recall my romantic days. I once met this beautiful lass and felt... Well, I don't know how to pronounce that. Fell with? So courageous for a high elf. I met her while swimming in the same waters that I accidentally locked one of the, my books in a chest some decades later. So very lovely she was, not nearly as complicated as that chest was. Thank you very much. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. On Steam, it's EverQuest 2 free to play your way, right? There are several, several... Others are just extensions, right? 
Um, so if I start brand new character on this server, can I start in Fade Arc or front? Or from the very beginning. You can start in either one, Lance. Um, if you want this server, Chris, you have to do the sub on the game. Yeah. So, Chris, you can download it. I think the Steam version and the website version are the same thing. I personally use the um, web version of the game, but I don't think it really matters. Either one. But if you're if you're if you're gonna play on Fallen Gate though, you're gonna have to sub to the game. I just want the I just want to play EQ2 normally. Oh, okay, I got you, got you. Yeah, so then you would just download the free to play one, and you can play the free to play with two character slots, I think. Unless you already have characters made. And then Shiny's asking Lance if he's on this server too. I think Lance is on, he's almost, he's up in the air about it. He was thinking about joining it anyways. Alright, so. It's the next spot. Burdockton's is to find his three books. Completing all of Burdockton's book quests rewards you with the investigation skill. Beware the shambling overgrowth 65 double up heroics. So now I need to do these three quests, right? After completing all three sub-quests and turning in the gumshoe guy. Okay, so let's pull up these, I guess. Hmm, Newton area. What you doing? Okay. Examine a shield on the wall in the Hall of Truth. Yay! Oh, got you, Lance. Okay. Did you get tired of um, Lord of the Rings, or you're just looking to play EverQuest 2? I got you, Chris. You got 90 hours on it on Steam. Uh, let's see what I got here. So you played, I think, is the command. So the creation time for this character was Tuesday, June 27th at 3.30 p.m. I have played 16 days, 21 hours, and 25 minutes total on this character. I could go into Skyfire and tell you all the played stats on those characters. I like to get games on Steam so everybody can see how many hours I've put into the game so they can judge me accordingly. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. we they're One of my co-workers, he plays a lot, a lot of Dota 2. And we give him shit about it all the time because he's raked in at over 3,000 hours in Dota 2. And we give him shit all the time about playing that game. And then we we all, we always call it League of Legends on purpose, so he gets really really mad at us because you know Dota Two is different than League of Legends. It's a completely different game. It's not really in my eyes. It's not really a different game. It's the same thing. All right, so gotta go to New Tenaria. That zone should be fun. All right, where is the zone for Newton area? Actually, I mean, there's only a few games I've I've done on Steam. I I do prefer like single player games. Yes, for sure. Steam, it just it's nice to be able to click install or uninstall from there, and I have to worry about it. Um, and it keeps the games auto updated, but normally I don't, I don't do like my MMOs. I try not to do on steam because there's always some kind of issue or they're on a completely different server than other things. Sometimes I've tried both Dota. There's too much going on. LOL seemed better to me. Yeah. I preferred LOL myself. 
But I'm not a big MOBA guy anymore. I, it was fun while it lasted. It was good. But, um... This is... I'm trying to think where the zone's at. Which one's easier? Greater Fate Arc or... Okay, well, we found the path to Greater Fate Arc, so we're just going to Greater Fate Arc. Um, Dota, I, I just don't get the... One, the new player experience is pretty terrible on both games because people get really mad at you really quick if you don't know what you're doing, even if you're starting. Like, they just get angry and violent really quick. So, like, I, I, try, I just don't do games like that. Like, if you're going to be toxic when I'm trying to learn the game, I don't need to be there. And like even if you look up like the um like Dota 2, if you look up the new player guide, it's like a 35 page PDF on how to play the game. And I'm just like, uh no, I'm good. I'll play Heroes of the Storm though. I like Heroes of the Storm. That was fun. It's easy. Simple. I go in for a few matches and get out, you know? free <laughs> I mean what's not to like about here is the storm plus you can play all the wow characters starcraft characters diablo characters now overwatch characters are in there too my son really likes here's the storm Yeah, it is hard, yeah. Uh, Mr. Sibley's always trying to get me to play um, League of Legends with him. I just, I don't get into those anymore. Like, I, I can go in and do a few matches, but then I'm pretty bored after that. Alright, so now I need to go in here. And I need to find the Hall of Truth. And I need to click on a shield that's on the wall. I feel like I'm going to die in here, though. Needs at least 100 hours to get into it. It's sad when communities of the games scare away the new people because of how toxic they are. They literally are killing their own game population. LOL being, of course, different because it's scale. Yeah, I mean, those games are too big to fail at this point. I probably will check out the Dota 2 card game that they're working on. But, um, I don't know. How old is my son? He is six. <laughs> yeah, I might need to, um, I, and when I say he likes to play Heroes of the Storm, I'm usually right next to him. Like, he doesn't play by himself or anything like that. And I usually only let him play the AI. Like, he won't play, he doesn't go to the live. Like where he's playing with other people. Oh no, it's all good. It's all good. He came on stream the other night. Or the other day, I guess. At least, well, his face was here for a little bit. Then we had an appearance from Barbie last night. Barbie was here. There's the shield. Examine the shield. Read the poem. Poem of the past. Accept. Exit. All right. I guess we got to kill things. These are level 56 heroics. I don't think I can kill them. Even though they are gray. Let's see. It's gonna be a long fight. 
Like Paragon, though, the community didn't kill that. Really, Fortnite did. But eventually would have been a... Yeah, I think so, too. I didn't try Paragon. I always wanted to. I never got into it, though. I just never got to downloading it and trying it out. But yeah, they... Um, Epic Games, they really hit a... They found a gold mine with Fortnite. So deciding to kill off Paragon was a good move for them, I think. In the long run. Oh, and it's not even a guaranteed update. Oh, it's going to be a long one in here. Sorry, I'm back. Wife decided that this would be the best time to flip our mattress. Great timing. <laughs> it's all good. Welcome back, Lance. I need to go now. It's 2200. I have to eat and go to sleep. Have a good one, man. Thank you, Chris. Thank you for stopping by, man. It's good seeing you again. You're in... um. Where are you at again? For some reason I want to say Australia, and it's not Australia. It's, um... You've told me before. I can't remember where you live. I know it's not in the States, for sure. I want to say it was Australia. I could be wrong, though. New Zealand? I don't know. Kelethon? <laughs> you live in Kelethon? Outer space? Croatia. Croatia. That's where it is, right? It's Croatia. I remember now. Oh, was I wrong? Croatia? No, I'm sure it's Croatia, right? Bro. See. Oh, there we go. Gotcha. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> now, need a Wheel of Fortune game in chat? That'd be crazy. Have like a hangman. How to do it? What happened? Oh, jeez. Who's in the lead right now? Is um, Reed still in the lead? Oh, yeah. I figured he'd lose it. It's all good. It's all good, Chris. Have a good night, man. Thank you. Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate it. All right, so that was a long fight to kill that thing. If anybody wants to group up and... Um, New Tenaria. I am here. I'm wondering if I should go start these other quests too. Masters, yep, we are. We were talking masters. I was telling her earlier today that Reed was gonna he was gonna lose the lead. He he always gets to the last round and something gets in his head and he can't stay with it. 
All the hype about Tiger, crazy, yeah. I feel bad for that man though. I can't, I can't imagine what it's like to have that kind of the media always on you like that. Thank you. Just when he was starting to get better, and then he just had a he had a had a terrible weekend. But yeah, yeah, we watch a lot of golf, Lance. We play golf too. Oh sh shit! I wasn't paying attention. All right, so looks like um. Yeah. Should be golfing over it. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to need a group for this. Let's go see if we can get the... What are the other ones I got to do? Are they in different um, zones? This one's also here. Uh, I need to... Starting the collection. Most collection quest okay. Uh, this is a collection one. Clickable book by binder. Copy. But these are pages on the ground. Oh, these are solo. These are solo up here. I can do these. It's a game on Steam. I used to play a lot of Wii Golf back when Wii's were a thing. Okay, that was... Oh, that's snuffing the Fire Knight. Don't need that one. Let's see what I can do here. Those are guards. Collection page floating in the wind. Similar to getting over it, but golf? Okay. I'm guessing the binder gives you the collection quest. Is that what what that's that's what I'm reading anyways. And it has to be a level 50 zone, like, can it be a zone that would be easily solo? I'd have to mentor down to get any kind of credit in here for mobs. Watch, one of these, one of these is going to be gray, I mean green. It's going to mess up the whole thing. The book's not here. There's the book. Examine, add, open the book, exit. All right. So we got that one. We got two of the quests that we need for this little area. And what was the third one? A watertight cause. Open a new tab. New Tenaria. 
prerequisites you must be working on. Okay. Quench the thirst devotion. Pick up the living. How do I get the quest? The solo quest is a subquest of Crusader of Fadeware in the Swords of Destiny timeline. It is one of three subquests. Yes, I get it. How do I start it? Pick up a living flow urn empty. There are eight of them in a given time in the enclave. I don't know, we might put a group together for New Tenere and just hang out in here so I can get these updates real quick. I don't know if these are the right ones. Step one, quench the thirst. Inspect the empty urn. Do I have an empty urn? I'm assuming I need to loot the empty urine first. Really messing up my rotation here. That guy's stuck. Oh. What the hell are you guys doing? What you guys up? Oh, bot group. Looks like a bot group. Don't you love these trails? <laughs> yeah. Dubstep. How many people are in the zone right now? 19 people are here? Serious? All right. Well, with that said, let's go back up to the front of the instance here, or zone, and we'll just kill the solo ones that we can until we can get some people or some help killing gray mobs. Because there seems to be a crap ton of people here. But I wish it would let me get this other quest. Examine the chest underwater. That's how to start. Okay, that's what I needed. That's what I was looking for. Way paste. I'll do that real quick.
interact with the chest. Accept. Now we need to go back up and go back to those urns. Which I wonder how we get back up from down here now. Might be a path or something. That's not a path. Maybe that was a path. CMM is looking for two more. Chainer bar DPS. I think I fought in this zone a lot too back in the day. A lot of this seems really familiar. Maybe that's not a bot group. Can't tell. Why am I going the wrong way for these urines? They were down here, weren't they? There we go. Pick up urine. Oh. What? What? Need to try and collect magic water from the element elementals known as water spirits. Those are down. I saw one. Well, how do I? Crap. Oh, that's nice. They don't have quests over them, quest markers over them, so I don't think these are the right things. Yeah, I don't think those are the right things, anyways. Alright, so let's look up that quest now to see exactly what the flip that's talking about. No, I don't even have to do that quest, right? In inspect the urn in your inventory to start a sub-quest to capture a living flow. Jump off the level and kill the water spirits level 54 up arrows. For three uncommon updates, this will complete the capture of the living flow and reward you with a living flow urn filled. Repeat the above step three times until you have four living flow urns filled with um urn 
of devotion. Take the field urns and dump them into the urn of devotion located at blah by night clicking. Why does it have to be so complicated? These quests, I'm telling you. There's another one. Okay. So these things not stop spawning? God, they, they just don't stop. What in the world? If they just keep respawning over and over again. I guess we'll just keep killing them over and over again. Need one more update, and that's just to do... One time. Interesting. What? That is a lot of water spirits.
like a lot, a lot. an achievement point and a living flow urn filled except now what do I need to all right jump off the levee kill water spirits for three uncommon updates this will complete the capture living flow and award you with a living flow urn repeat the above three steps until you have four living flow urns so i don't need to do that quest is that is that what that's telling me yeah so complete it three more times okay but i don't because this has a quest i don't want to do that right or no, that's for, it's required by, okay, okay, yeah, I got you, I got you. I thought it gave a quest. Three more times, and then another four more times, okay. Fun. Super fun. Crap, how did I get up? It's over this way. Don't lose all your copper, shiny. All that gambling. So now I have to go get the urn again. Kill three more or get three more updates. Rinse and repeat. Rinse and repeat. Worst luck ever. Hopefully I'll do better in the raid tonight. <laughs> yeah. So you get all the you get all the bad luck out now, so when the raid comes in you have good luck. Of course he's gonna stun me.
That's two updates. Oh yeah, that was three in a row. Nice. Somebody in general was like, do channelers set default to forced, ranged, melee, or automatic? First reply, set to Wombo. Pick up the urn. Urn, yarn, yarn. Well, this isn't going to be a three and out. Why did I click that? Okay, I just subbed for EQ2 and created an evil character. However, I wanted to start in Kelethin. Is it neutral? Um, I don't know. Is Kelethin neutral, guys? I'm trying to think. I think it's... I think it's good aligned. Because I think there's dark light for evil instead of Kelethon. Alright, that's number three. Said to do it three times, right? Repeat this above three steps until you have four living or okay I need four. I need to do one more. You can start in Neeric or Freeport, is what Shiny is saying. Oh, 
What class are you making, Lance? Yep. Or Gorowin when ROK comes out. Still got about five. How, how long till ROK? Is it six weeks? Seven weeks? Longer? Less? I don't know. About seven weeks. Loved RK back in the day, hell yeah. Yeah, it's one of my favorite expansions too, hardware. I'll probably spend a lot of time inside ROK. So many timelines and dungeons to run. I might just come back for that. Yeah, that's a lot of people are waiting for um, Canark to hit. So, server will be pretty busy once it comes down the tubes. Not that it's not busy right now. I just know there's a lot of people that have been that are just gonna wait till that content comes out before they get back into it. Not sure yet. My main is Hunter, and I also have a Conjurer. Not a good tank or heal, so my choices are limited. All right, Living Flow. That's the number four. So it says, let me catch up on these chants. Um, oh, have faith, Lance. Might just come back for that. Is there a character in Faith? That's awesome. Yeah. Hurry, come back so you can give you level cap before it goes live. There's a little bit of a lull, but you're right, Revis. ROK will be er rocking. I got you, Lilina. <laughs> yeah, um, a lot. I think I think it'll be pretty busy, at least the first few weeks of ROK. I just don't know how fast we're gonna get through content, or how fast the big guilds are gonna get through content. So I don't know. But honestly, after ROK. I don't know how the server's going to do, in my opinion. I mean, I could be wrong. Maybe the server will continue to go crazy as it is, and Fallen Gate will be, you know, a really good server. But after ROK, I know that's basically when I started losing interest in EverQuest 2. was after I did a lot of stuff in ROK, and I was starting to get bored with it. But that was also due to other MMOs that were being released at the time, and stuff like that. Oh yeah, they, yeah. There's that's why I liked ROK a lot too, is because of the solo lines. They were fun. They were intriguing. Plenty of things to do. Um, I don't remember which expansion it was, but which expansion was the um, the shard armor where you had to do like quests to get shards, and you'd spend the shards on the um, armor sets to build. Jorm made a character and shrouded the avatar. Shut up. TSO, TSO, that's what it was. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I did those for a little bit, but then I got so far behind on that content that I just lost interest in the game.
<laughs> Echo. <laughs> Jorm's playing. Jorm downloaded Shroud of the Avatar and made a character. Nice, man. Grinder's Paradise, yeah. See, I like... The, it's weird, because I do like to grind in, in my MMOs. Like, I find it soothing sometimes to grind, but there are times also that I like doing the group content and, you know, quest lines and stuff like that. All right, so now we need to go quench the thirst of the devotion. And that is a... Where is that at? So you can keep filling it till you have eight. What do you need? Oh, so I should do I should keep doing that quest then, Jorm? Is that what you meant by four more times? So like if I can I can keep doing it until I have eight and then go turn in everything? That's what the week the wiki is showing, anyways. Guys, my kids are like super hyper right now. Like, I can feel the energy coming from the other room. And it's scary. Give me an update, guys. Any update. There's not a lot of solo guys around here. Oh, is this the thing I need to click on? That's a tablet. That, that can't be the thing I need to click on, is it? Oh, hi. Yeah, 105. Two updates. Will it be three? Yes. Just need two more of those. Alright, so I'm assuming this is the thing I need to do whatever with. Oh. Oh. 
Are you serious right now? Let me read this again. Take the filled urns and dump them into the urn urn of devotion located at by, by right clicking on the urn of devotion. You have jumped down to the lower level of the structure from the entrance to the bridge. That's not what I need. Where are these urns? I will figure this out. I don't see any urns. See lights? See this ugly looking thing? By right clicking on the urn of devotion, use you have to jump down to the lower level of the structure from the entrance bridge. Why must you be such a pain? But all right, this is the entrance. There it is. Fill the urn. Urn. There's one. There's two. Alright, so now I gotta do it one more time. Where the flip am I now? Words of all general chat. I'm on chapter 10 of Ready Player One. In case you guys were wondering the status of the, the book reading. I started doing a combination of the audiobook and the physical book. I'd really like to go see the movie before it's out of theaters. Looks like the guild's got a clack group going on. Anybody wants to join them? Clacknon or Clackacon? Clackacon? However, you want to pronounce the name of that instance zone. Get the urn. Urn. Quest three times, four times. Thank you. 
from now, they're going to be stingy with the updates. Come on. What weapon am I using again? Walking stab of zero mark la la. Hmm. One more update. Messing up my whole rotation on that guy. Wow, I'm almost out of water spirits and I haven't gotten three updates. Lance Link has invited to join your group in Greater Fadark. What? What's up, Lance? I get holler if you want a guild invite or whatever. Sir, um, Lelina or Shiny will throw you one. It's all good. Guilds help a lot, man. I will take the guild invite. Um, Shiny, are you still in game? Yay! What'd you end up making? Illusionist? Nice. Very nice, man. Be 
People are always wanting them chainers. Welcome to the guild, man. Call her if you need anything or if you need help with anything, let us know. Gonna go ahead and add you to the friends list too while I'm thinking about it. Community Lance Link. Add. Save this list. Okay. I need to import that on my wizard. I need to import vi vice versa too because he has friends on his list that I don't have over here on Rebus. I wish the friends list went account wide or at least server wide. So if I made, if I have four of the characters, I wish all four characters had the same friend, same friend list, but it doesn't work that way for some reason. You have to like import the friends list on each new character. Unless I'm doing something totally wrong. But my friends list is different on my wizard and my inquisitor than it is on my monk. Alright, that's two. You're a returning player to EverQuest 2 though, right Lance? Like you've played before. This isn't your first go around with it. Cause I mean, you've been giving us pointers from Twitch chat all the time. You're one of the ones that, um, you did like 5,000 quests or something like that as well. Not his first rodeo? Yeah. <laughs> I'm 11 year veteran. Never been at a guild though? Wow. Okay. Quest two more times. Will I be able to talk to you on my mic? If so, how do I set that up? All right, so if you go into um, options, voice options right there, you'll see the voice chat. And it'll let you enable voice chat from there. And then you can set up all the other um, channels that you want to do. And your push to talk key, you can change that. I think I have mine set to um, left control. And then it wants you to do your mic input which I actually need to change that. I want that to be at output device. I want to be, oh, it's not showing me which one that is. 
that will be set to default, I guess. You, then you can do the, the mic testing and stuff like that so you can see how, see how you sound to make sure it doesn't have a lot of static or whatever. And then accept. And then you can join the group channel, which you're in there. Testing, testing. And then if you want to hear your voice on uh, on stream. The guild uses it a lot too because you're originally I think when you first sign in you sign into the um, guild chat first but they chat a lot in there as well there's a few voicers in there there is a guild discord um, you probably saw it in the um, guild message as well if you have Discord. Highly recommend using it. It's a good source of information, announcements, guild news, all that fun stuff. All the shenanigans. I believe you can have voice channels inside of Request 2 as well. So you can make up channels and join them. So you don't have can to you be. Can hear groomed. me? Yep, I can hear you. You're good. One more update. Can you hear me? I can hear you just fine. There we go. Hate fighting in the water. Obviously, Dirty. What's I'm up, on man? Level one. Cursory. Oh yeah. Try to level up as much as I can. It's all good, man. What's up, Dirty? How's it going? Holy shit, Rebus is fucking live. <laughs> Every Tuesday, Saturday, and Sunday, man. Oh yeah, it's quick. I mean, well, it's not like super quick, but I mean. <laughs> I got you dirty. I'm just going to have to learn to uh, press this button to talk. Yeah, I think you, you can set it for voice active, but it usually causes issues. I need to do that one more time. One more time, then I can go pour these into the urn of devotion. And hopefully, I think that's the last part of this. Yeah. And collect the reward after that. Yeah, I'm live a little later on Sunday. We had a family luncheon that we went to today. Normally on Sundays, I try to go live around 10 a.m. Somewhere between 10 and 11. And we usually do alternate Sundays where we play our low-level characters. Or alternate characters in general and we do some dungeon content questing and all that I wish I could do setup for all my characters uh, set everything up again. I think you can it you save it saves the interface so like if you whatever settings you do right now on this character um, then you can load UI settings and it pulls all that into the, another character yeah I've done that uh, it's just that uh my targeting is different. I'm going to have to reset the target. Oh, uh, okay. But we postponed alternate Sunday today. Because I'm going to try to catch up on some of my Sword of Destiny timeline. Which is what I've been working on today so far. And we were going to do some EOF instance instances, but... um. 
think I went live a little later than Nid expected, and Jorm has been busy in Castle Mismore doing an update for Sword of Destiny, so. We'll have to hit the UF instances another day. Jorm informed me that he made a character in Shroud of the Avatar. Very cool. We'll be playing that on Tuesdays. Tuesday night around 6 p.m. Eastern. Finding our way through the game. And then Saturdays and Sundays are dedicated to EverQuest 2. I'm probably going to be able to stream Thursday this week, and I'm more than likely will stream EverQuest 2. So we can do some UF, inst UF inst instances on Thursday. Alright, that's number four, so now we can go turn that in. Well, actually, Thursday, yeah, I should be able to. Yeah, I should be able to stream on Thursday, I think. September Girls got plans. I got an eye appointment after work. Who's this guy? Who's this guy? Cryer? Uh, I need to go over there. That's where I'm supposed to be. Then we need to drop down. Oh, nope. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm in the right spot. Um, drop down. There's the urn. Urn. Three. And four. Now I need to go back to the underwater chest, which is right over here. There it is. Yay! Inspect the chest. Open the latch. Got one of my books. Yeah, buddy. Moving up in the world. Pretty cool. So we got one of those. Um, did, does that? Yeah, it went right into a quest log, I'm assuming. So that's one done. What is this quest? That wasn't part of the... Uh, I have a collection is the other one. I must pray to the mother in the daylight. I must pray to the mother in night. What? I don't know what that quest is, so we're just going to turn that one off. I think they got that from the podium thing. Oh, you know what I sh... Man, what I should have did when I was over there? Check for the um, guards. They were on the tower. Go back. Probably over in that one too, because these don't count. Hope everybody's having a good Sunday. Thank you guys for stopping in and hanging out. I appreciate it. If anybody's new to the channel, welcome. Thank you. Hopefully Sunday's treating you right. Hopefully I'm fulfilling whatever nostalgia need that you're needing right now, playing EverQuest 2. Alright, go out here, get 
some of these guys to kill. There's number four. Oh, updated. Alright, so we got five of those. Stand up. And I got a chest here. Fire Knight, page seven. We already did that one. Alright, so now I need to find a dozen Coda Blooms to offer the flames. And this one I can close out. That's the collection quest. The Coda Blooms. Random spawns. Find them as glowing flowers around any trees in the zone. Locations found to date listed on the top page of this article. Okay. Come on, let just let me jump over this. So little... confused. What's up? I'm watching your stream and hearing you on the stream. Oh. <laughs> it's all good. So I just, I just turned the bike. It's maybe my first rodeo, but I fall off the course some. I got you. Alright, so I think there's trees, uh, where there, there were trees up I'll be front. right back, uh, we have, uh, some fire trucks and, uh, police officer. Oh. I'll be back. Alrighty, man. Lance has got fire trucks and police officers. That's, uh, interesting. Some trees over here. Don't see any quest updates. I think most of the updates are going to take place... I remember we're back in this area. Yeah. Let's go back in there. See if we can click on some flowers. Hopefully there's no greens. These are level 56. Page two. Page four. Don't be running at me like that. Scaring the crap out of me. Page do I need? I did two, three, four, five, six. I need page one. Oh, 
That's it. Very nice. Why do these have feathers? What do I need these for? I don't know what I need those for, but let's look for the flowers and then we can figure out if we need to kill those or not. Oh, he's green. None of these guys are green. Don't see any flowers back here. There's one rose. I wonder if I can kill... Nope, those are linked. I won't be able to kill those. You're hey, calm your shit, alright? Bunch of racists. That one's going to be too close. Can't get that one. Can't see target. It's right there in front of me. Is it worth it? Let's see what can happen here. Can I solo a green three up arrow? Wow. As a monk. Don't think so, because he is whooping my ass. Have a heal. Oh, he heals too. Okay, great. Nope, 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 nope. Wasn't gonna happen. I tried. Got him down to like 40.
All right, just need to wait for some respawns. We'll run around, check, and see if there's any others, though. If I remember right, these spawned all along the um, path here. Just got to be careful for green mobs. Okay, I'm back. Welcome back. Everything good? Yeah, it's in another building. Ah. We had a we had a fire about uh, in January in my building. Just not sure what's going on there. It's it's not really a nice area to live in, but uh, uh, I got gotcha. you. Any greenies? So anyway, uh, right now I'm on level three. Nice. Yeah, I think just following the quest lines until you get to about level 12 or 15, I think. Then you can start doing the low-level dungeon runs, and you'll probably get experience faster that way. I'm going to try to do this differently. What I normally do, I, I go in and uh, do every quest. But I know what to do. I don't know how to... Uh, Power level. Oh, I got you. You see, Viz? No. Good shit. Go back here and get these then. Uh, he sees him, Viz. Which is fine. Did he aggro me? He did not. All right, so we got those. Now we need to see. I need four of the kudas. Kudas, kudas, kudas. Where do I get those? Century of Righteousness. We patrol the area around the Temple of Growth. Okay. Yep, those were the. I do have a question, though. What's up? Um. I invited you, but I don't see your name on my screen. On the interface, or where are you looking at? Yeah, on the interface. Um, I think the default location for the group window is on the left side. Right now, I've, I've added you as a friend on the community. But... Yeah. Are you talking about in the group window? Is that what you were saying? Uh, no, it's on the um, just the interface itself. Well, I see your on name. Your stream, I see. Yeah, I have it down in the voice box, which is um, you can see what voice channels you're in by hitting V. I think it's the default key. And then there's the group window that I have up. Let's see if I can kill one of these pretty easily. Where the fuck to go? Okay. Like I said, I've never... I never really grouped before, so it's oh, very yeah. new to me. I believe it after eleven years. <laughs> I mean, there's so, you, like I said, there's so much content in this game. Oh yeah, you yeah. Can, you, you can start. You can start from scratch, you know. And and I worked a lot of the, the gray levels. And and the only thing that I really obviously haven't done is the last part of the content some of the raids 
But, you know, I could solo a lot of the low level. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there's so much, like, the solo timelines usually fill up most of the time. So even these gray models I'll have are killing to, uh, me. Look at this offline. Everything. It's all good. Come on. Alright, well, that's just going to take a bit of, um, slowness. Oh, these are lore. You've already collected this item. I don't think I can sell these on the broker either, can I? Stand in the purple fire. Good stuff. I'm still at attack those guys. Do I not? Oh, I do have food. So I'm assuming I gotta turn in that collection quest to um, get the next book. Let me go ahead and go do that. Head over here to South Kinos. Ice Bear, Milton. Got 91 points. Grab this daily while well I'm thinking met. about it. Welcome back to the game. I'm going to go ahead and get out of here, though. Okay. Uh, I'll talk to you soon. Yeah, man. Like I said, if you need anything, just let us know. Also, the guild is very helpful, so if you need anything, just chat them up in there. Will do. Thank you very much. No problem. All right. Go ahead. Leave group. 
All right, guys, that's going to do it for me today. Thank you guys for hanging out and watching me play video games. I appreciate it. Do some shout outs real quick. Um, Jorm with the 200 bits. Thank you, man. Thank you for the 200 bits. I appreciate it. Thank you for supporting the channel. All the subscribers, thank you for supporting the channel. You guys are what keeps the channel going. Um, we're going to be live again on Tuesday. We're going to play some Shroud of the Avatar on Tuesday. Unless for some reason the game's down or something happens. But as of right now, Shroud of the Avatar is on the calendar for 6 p.m. Eastern. We'll be doing that. I'm not sure what I'll be doing in the game yet. I'm working on a new build for that. So I'm working on making a kind of double dagger death magic character. This is what I've been working on with him. And we're going to try to do some crafting because I need some better armor and weapons. And I want to look into what I need to do to buy land in that game as well. Or like a house, you know, and get into that kind of content. But thank you guys for hanging out today. I appreciate it. Hope everybody had a good time. Hope you have a good rest of your Sunday. Good luck on raids tonight. Relapse. Shiny. Lalina. Everybody that's been doing the raids tonight. Good luck. May you get all the fat loot. But yep, that's going to do it for me today. Thank you guys for hanging out. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what's going on. Is there anybody I can host today? Not really. But all right, guys. Y'all have a good one. Thank you for watching. If you're watching this on replay. I appreciate it. Thank you. I don't think there's any other channel news we need to talk about. I'm trying to... I've got the bot in Discord. I'm trying to link it so you can do commands in Discord as well. But we'll worry about that another day. But um, that's it, guys. Y'all have a good rest of your Sunday. I will see you again on Tuesday. Thank you, guys.